All right. This is Challenge Pro Wrestling presented by PPW Premier Pro Wrestling. First of all, thanks for tuning in this week. This week, what you're going to see is a match from last Saturday night where Not Bad Chad faces Jose Acosta right in the middle of the King Kong Bundy Memorial Tournament, which you can watch in its entirety on Pivot Share. Now, last week's show will be in its entirety on Pivot Share, and the last match during the tournament, the Memorial Tournament for King Kong Bundy, Chris Pallies, will be also available on Patreon if that's where you support us, or support us on both. That being said, I've said it before and I'll say it again, pro wrestling, is and always has been and is supposed to be an infomercial that is so entertaining you don't know that you're being entertained by said infomercial. The infomercial, the way to support us is on Patreon. Our podcast, I've been told, is worth what we charge on Patreon. You're not going to want to miss that. Then Pivot Share, our subscription service, and again, Pro Wrestling Tees. We got shirts coming out of our ass sideways, some great shirts. So this week, what you're going to see on Challenge Pro Wrestling is, like I said, Not Bad Chad versus Jose Acosta. Not Bad Chad being the Challenge Pro Cup holder and Jose Acosta being the crown jewel, the PPW Heavyweight World Champion. And then we're going to take a little trip down memory lane. You're going to see a rare matchup between the love machine, Matt Longtime, and PPW's own Pancho, which occurred sometime in the spring or summer of 2020. That was one hell of a matchup. Here's one of the things that you'll find here that you won't find anywhere else. Let's talk for a second about the Love Machine Matt Longtime. I met the Love Machine Matt Longtime when he was 18 years old. I'm going to go ahead and say it had to be over 20 years ago. I got involved with Matt Longtime in the ring and helped retrain him with the old company which is called the North American Wrestling Federation. And 20 some odd years ago, I put Matt Longtime directly in touch with World Wrestling Entertainment where you can check the annals if you want to. He was a regular in dark matches on Velocity and Sunday Night Heat and other various WWE programming. He was very well loved by World Wrestling Entertainment. It finally got to the point where they were using him three times a month. But Matt Longtime suffered a terrible loss in his personal life, which took a lot of his concentration up to that point away from wrestling and anything to deal with the death of someone very close to him. And at that point, Matt Longtime, I'm not going to say gave up on wrestling, but became more of a hobby than making a living. So. You're going to want to see that, so wait up to the end of the program, and I'll check back with you right before we give you the sign out. Champion versus champion here in the King Kong Bundy Memorial Tournament of 2020. The Challenge Pro Champion, Not Bad Chad, one-on-one -on -one against the World Heavyweight Champion, Jose Acosta. Two very talented wrestlers in that ring. Not bad, Chad. One of, if not the most versatile athlete in Premier Pro Wrestling. This is something that I like to see with these randomly drawn scenarios. You've got two fan favorites going out there. You've got the fans behind both of them. And it's just going to be some cool stuff to see who's the better man. Probably not going to see any cheating, probably not going to see any biting, kicking, punching, or choking, hair pulling, tights, so just wrestling. Not bad Chad, probably the most versatile guy on the roster. Jose Acosta, the crown jewel of the roster, currently PW World Heavyweight Champion. And don't forget, he's got a doctorate in kicks. Like I said, so. Look at the versatility of Mount Bad. Jose Acosta, nice transition into the overhand wrist lock while he controls Chad's lower body with his right leg. It makes it harder to get out of there. That way you're working from on top, you're attacking, just like the Art of War says, you always want to fight your war from that high spot, right? Absolutely. No? Acosta just affirmed, Acosta just affirmed, Sensei, snap, Mayor! 
Back to Young. Good job. Good job. Fans delighted. Look at, oh, look at not Chad. Bad Chad's bridging bridge. upward. I told you. Did I tell you this guy was versatile or did I tell you this guy was versatile? But Jose still has that overhand wrist lock locked in tight. Yeah, his fingers are interlaced. But not bad Chad. Able to boogie out and reverse it on Jose Acosta. Good job. Great back and forth. We're only a couple minutes in. I feel like we've been here for 10. Now Chad is the world champion, grounded. These guys give you your money's worth or what? Jose Acosta backs Chad in. Nice, I bet we're gonna see a clean break. If not, we're gonna see something quick. Hey, I love it. They got my my uh, my uh, respect on that one. And the show of respect Admiration. between the two. Oh, nice. Thinking the same thing, trying to keep the positive energy up in this building. It's nice to see once in a while in wrestling, ain't it? Okay, oh, 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 gives him a leg sweep with just the leg. And now Chad says, okay, I can do that too. I don't need the leg though. Schoolboy. Going move for move here in the first three minutes of this match. Jose Acosta goes to the outside and hits the reset button. Hey, if Chad's got one on his tricep on that tattoo, Jose has to do something. All Chad's gotta do is push a button, right? And Jose waist goes lock. low with the back, uh, excuse me, with the waist lock, like you said. But Chad gives him a nice judo throw, also combo arm drag, ends up with the figure four on the arm in the middle of the <laughs> ring. No, not bad Chad fighting from that higher position. Jose Acosta up to his feet, takes Chad back, no trunks, which is nice, no hair, which is nice. Irish whip reversed by Chad. Nice elbow, Jose ran right into that one. Chad telegraphed it. Jose's in the corner. Chad giving him all the room he could possibly want to get back up to his feet. He wants to win this legitimately in the middle of the ring in advance. There's only one thing not bad Chad loves more than dancing, and that is competition. And he knows he's going to get a handful of competition here from Jose Acosta, and that's the way Chad likes it. Jose pulls those legs out. Kind of makes it unfair. Nice though. Chad again with the versatility. Round off into an elbow. Followed up by a snapmare. And then he goes right back to the arms. Got an overhand wrist lock locked in on the champ. And it's the Challenge Pro Champion in charge of the World Heavyweight Champion right now. Yeah. That Challenge Pro Championship is nothing to be sneered at. That is a triple threat championship. Look at Acosta get those feet. Oh, and a melee kick right to the side of the head. That was creative, that was innovation right there. Goes a minute the corner. Oh, now it's his turn to throw an elbow in the corner. Oh, we know what's coming. Dives right over. Hits the shining wizard, wizard. that might do it. for the cover, one, two, three. Chad kicks out right at three. Remember, this match has to be won by a five count. Five minutes have expired in the time limit. Five minutes gone. Not bad, Chad, reaching for the ropes. Centimeters away. We're only Not five minutes into this enough. match, and we've already seen about 20 oh, minutes he's of wrestling so jam close, packed. Into so it. close. He's got a finger up. He actually grabbed the rope. He got a break, and I'd expect nothing less from Jose Acosta. A nice, clean break. Capitalizing off of that break though. Chad versus the breaks. Tackle. Turns Chad inside out. And Jose winding up is probably gonna throw a kick at him. He is oh, caught him right he in got the arm. every inch of it. Caught him right in the left arm. Look in that midsection of Chad. Forearm. Not a fist, a forearm. That's nice. Irish whip, reversed by Chad. Jose puts that foot up. Jose sitting on the top rope. Chad staggering. Cut 
Buster from the top. Goes for the cover. One, two, three count only. Poor Chad. Boy, that really took a lot out of him. You can see how pink Chad is from the waist up now. And now Jose slowing the pace again with that overhand wrist lock, wearing Chad down while also giving himself a chance to breathe. I don't know if you notice it, but Chad smacked his head on that canvas. He smacked his heart on that sharp buster. No matter what happens, if you get into a daze like that, in the middle of a match with your adrenaline going, there's a moment of panic. You don't know where you are. You don't know if you're dreaming. You don't know if it's real. And then all of a sudden it occurs to you where you are. Good job getting out of that hole, though. Swing better. Oh, 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 oh Chad goes to the cross body. Chad catches him and turns it into an airplane spin. Told you about Chad's versatility. Now they're both dizzy though, but Chad seems to have it more together. It was his move. And here comes a slap drop turn to the face. One, two, three. Three count only. Oh, if this had been a regular match, he would have just pinned the world champion. He'd be the champ right now. Well, actually, you have to do it two more times because all of our championship, world championship matches are two out of three falls. First to two. A unique no, concept Chad. here in Premier Pro Wrestling, much like the annual King Kong Bundy Memorial Tournament that we're witnessing right now. Chad with the upper hand, but he's worse for that too. Not a lot behind that shoulder. He's sucking wind, Jose sucking wind. You can see this guy sweat and working their asses off. Oh! And Chad went out. face first into the canvas. Jose with the fist. One, two, three. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, Chad, I don't know where he got that from, man, but he was able to kick out. What an onslaught. You can see Chad struggling. Jose's very tired, too. Energy up in this house tonight. Chad, I don't know, man. He's fighting on instinct. He's doing a great job. Oh, oh unbelievable. It's like a Ghostbuster. Foot is in the rope, smart. Takes less energy to do that than it does to kick out at this point. Chad on the apron, he's going for that Chad Tom bomb. He lands it, turns Jose in. Beautiful round off, one, two, three. Oh, man. Not bad, Chad. See, again, the versatility. There's nothing this guy can't do in the ring. Chad can fly, he can wrestle. Got balls, big balls. Big giant Chad balls, man. Up and over. Where does Jose get the energy? Kicks him in the ring. It was a hook! It was a beautiful hook kick followed by a DDT. One, two, three. Oh, Chad kicks out at two. Gotta be frustrated, because those moves, the, Jose is doing nothing wrong out there. It's just Chad being resilient. What did I tell you about era competition, man? There's a knee to the midsection as Another Jose one. drives Chad back into the corner. But these guys are staggering. They're working hard. We're 10 minutes in, man. Back and forth. Chad's line, clothesline. This time he goes to the monkey flip, sends it across the halfway across the ring. Chad gets him up for the slam. Unbelievable. Go for a cover. One, two, three. Oh, for a four count. Ten minutes have expired the time limit. Twenty minutes remain. Once again, it's got to be frustrating for both these guys. You're not doing anything wrong. It just takes so much more to pin a guy for five seconds. Think of how hard it is to pin a guy for three. Oh, oh Chad too misses Too much the time, Showboating. Too much time. I'm right in the chest. Cover. One, two, three, four. Oh! Unbelievable. Like I said, think of how hard it is to pin a man for three. Tonight, these guys have got to hold him down for the count of five. Chad to the top. Yeah, yeah, body. One, two, three. Oh, 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 Back and forth. I can't believe the back and forth the level of respect, the level of talent we've seen in this matchup tonight. Oh, 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 say. 
He must have eyes on his feet, man. He can hit you with those kicks from absolutely anywhere. There's Three. another Shining Wizard. Beautiful. Kicks in a row. One, two, three, four. Oh, not bad chance somehow. Finds his way to kick out before Jose Acosta advances in the tournament. And Jose is smile on his face. Yeah, he knows man. he's getting the absolute best from not bad chance. And vice versa. Nope, Chad. Chad and Jose goes to the between. outside. Chad's got a moment to breathe now. Oh, oh, oh. Look at not bad Chad. We're going to see air Chad in about two seconds here. What I tell you? Versatility or what? There's nothing he can't do in this ring. He's suplexing. He's punching. He's surviving the kicks of Jose Acosta. And we just saw a beautiful plancha from the top over the top rope. One, two, three. Oh, and Jose Acosta somehow finds a wherewithal. He just showed us why he wears that World Heavyweight Championship belt. Now for 26 tapings, Jose Acosta has been world champion. Irish whip in. Chad wiggles out. Jose wiggles out. Table suplex. And now the playing field's leveled. Jose's trying to get over there and capitalize. One, two, three. Oh, that was almost it. That should have been it. A mortal man, that would have been it. Jose Acosta would advance. Not bad, Chad. Digging down deep. Combination of heart and instinct. Chad fighting back. We were talking about that heart just a second ago. Forearms. Irish whip across the ring. Jose at the last fraction of a second. Jose Acosta sitting on the top rope. I, for one, can't wait to see what's coming. Jose's so got a measured. Close line and not bad. Chad's head bounced off of that map. Jose Acosta took everything he had in him so he can't get over there and capitalize. Both men are down. Referees counted to five. Chad seems to be recovering quicker. There goes Jose. Chad's up to his feet first. Jose Acosta is up to his feet, but turns around and now is coming with not bad Chad right now. Beautiful place drop kick. Chad is jacked up, man. On with a bicycle kick of his own. Can he get Jose over and hold him down for five? Three, four. Oh, Jose, it cost that four and a half seconds. Not bad, Chad. You're doing nothing wrong tonight, my friend. It's just nearly impossible to pin a man for five seconds. You may as well shoot him or tase him and go for a cover, you know? Not bad, Chad. Means business with those forearms. Keeping the upper hand that way on Jose Acosta. This big across the ring. He goes up and over. Don't know where he gets the energy from. Oh, Chad's nice head hit right in. And here we go. A counter roll. One, two, three, four, five. Here's your winner. The Premier Pro Wrestling World Heavyweight Champion, El Guerrero, Jose Acosta.
Poncho shot off his mouth and said he could take on anyone, anytime, and that brought out the love machine, Matt Longtime. Now let me tell you something. Whenever the love machine comes in and makes a special appearance, I love it and I hate it. I love it for the obvious reasons. This guy is amazing. He's amazingly funny. I hate it because I broke this kid into the industry when he was 18 years old, and now he's a grizzled veteran. What does that make me? Older than dirt, that's what. But anyway, I'm always going to be behind him, and he's got my heart. And Pancho, he doesn't want any part of the love machine. Yeah, he's praying, the, look at that, crossing his heart, praying before he gets in the ring with the veteran. Well, bringing God into it, I mean, definitely this is a desperate man that might be rejecting or regretting the fact that he called himself Mr. Wrestling, and he, in fact, is the one that said he could beat anyone at any time. Look, at he is. He's actually telling Matt Longtime, I'm sorry. Yeah! And now there's Longtime playing some mind games with Poncho. And now it looks like we have a, uh, a pose down and a dance-off all rolled into one. <laughs> He's charging up with uh, calling on that flossing power. Flossing power? What does flossing do for you? Why do they call that flossing? I don't know. Are you supposed to? I don't understand. It's I, nothing I, to do with I the mean, it, it looks like a and we're really off. Collar and elbow here. Wait, he's got the hair. He's got the hair. Ooh. And that chop was just meant to be disrespectful. I will guarantee you he's going to live to regret that move. In a long time, though, giving him a little bit of credit. Well, he's crafty, man. This guy's been up and down the roads quite a bit. He's very seasoned. Hey! He's got him by the hair. There was a time, and this is a shoot, where World Wrestling Entertainment was very interested in this guy. Uh-oh, I'm telling you, I told you he's going to live to regret this. Sorry, kid, it's going to hurt you way more than it's going to hurt long. And Poncho realizes... Oh! My goodness. Samoa fucking Joe who? Jeez, did you hear that? The king of hardcore. Oh, my God. He just pulled about seven of the eight layers of skin. Oh, look at Poncho. He's checking his nipples. Oh, my God. He's I checking think to make it, sure his nipples are still attached. I think his nipple flew into the front row. Unbelievable. He can tap. He can tap if he wants to. Did I tell you or did I tell you he was going to live to regret that? Oh, yeah. Poncho running his mouth once too often. And if that, if that chop wasn't enough to make him wake up, I don't know what will be. Like I said, Samoa Joe, who? No, oh, jeez, did you see that chop? Where's your nipple? One of the kids said in the crowd. Collar and elbow tie up. Oh long God, time oh backing punch oh into the corner. Oh my God, oh my God. He better hope and pray long time doesn't have another chop in store for him. He better hope and pray. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. Oh God bless. Oh, I just heard the watch. Oh! <laughs> and here comes Poncho out of the oh, ring. Oh, dude. I would rather be shot. I, I would rather be shot by a 22. I'd rather be shot by a 22 than get one of Matt Longtime's uh, chops like that. I mean, maybe shoot me in the arm. The 22 is going to bounce around a little bit, but it's not going to penetrate. What is he doing now? He's Poncho is taping. His oh, nipples. Oh, for the love of Tony Pilla. He's got tape on. He's got like pasties. He was able to acquire some athletic tape on the doctor's table, and now he's putting it on his nipples like somehow that is going to save him in this matchup. I mean, I don't know. Well, he's not thinking about thinking. What, what he's going to have to do to get that off after the match. I think that, oh, my God. I'm thinking in theory this makes sense, but you just brought up a great point. Matt Longtime is not going to miss an opportunity. You look ridiculous. I love Matt I, Longtime. I don't think Pancho cares. I think at this point it's more about function than fashion. Oh, that looks terrible. Yeah. Oh my god, can you believe Pancho's this? actually inviting him. Oh, oh no, 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 no. It's a nipple claw. This is legal. This is legal. Oh, you pull the tape off oh. of the nipples along with the nipple here. And then he throws it into the crowd. People are running for their lives. Oh. Pancho just got a free wax courtesy oh. of a love machine. I don't know what I feel more bad for him about, the, the purple nurple or having that tape ripped off. I just hope he doesn't get breast cancer. Oh! 
And Poncho so quick to take advantage of that. Oh, unbelievable. For a long time. I don't know who I feel worse for right now. Jeez. I, something shouldn't happen in a wrestling ring. I mean, oh my God. Poor long time. Now after long time, spent time humiliating Poncho, Poncho's trying to return the favor. Oh! Dropkick in the corner. Poor long time, he wasn't expecting that. Look at the people love him. One, no, one count only, Matt Long Time kicking out with authority. Oh, Matt Long Time fighting back. Puts that backhand in. <laughs> oh, 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 my God. Oh. Oh. Sometimes a picture's worth a thousand words. You see what's going on here. Poncho's chest is completely red. Poncho, I'm surprised. Like I said, it looked like he chopped off seven layers, the eight layers of skin on his chest. Look at Poncho. Here we go again. From the clown to the killer, it switches just like that. There's absolutely no... Oh! Oh, and that's just... Ooh. Not literally pounding the spit out of Matt Longtime. Yeah, spitting ass is flying. Poncho's really taking it too long time. And I'm kind of surprised to see it at this point that it's escalated to this, you know? Look at Longtime, the consummate professional. Fighting up, not gonna give. He's not gonna give. Poncho in the corner, and what's he gonna do? Oh, he throws his head into the turn Oh, long time, long time stumbling around. Oh! Oh! Right to the eyes. Oh! Every time he goes to get the upper hand on him, long time. Ends up getting a thumb in the eye or bit in the ear. You know what I'm saying? Looking though, he's literally using Poncho to try to get up to his feet. He's not giving up. Oh, geez, I think he's going to live to regret this just like he did earlier. Oh! Oh, and a shot to the midsection from the love machine. Oh, signs of life. Signs of life, my brother. Look at him work over the midsection from the knees. Oh, it's the same thing we saw him do on Eddie Cruz. Poncho oh. driving the knee right into the face of Matt Longtime. Longtime. Longtime might be out. He's not moving. I was just going to say it. Hooks the leg this one, time. One, two. two. Oh, unbelievable that Longtime was able to have the wherewithal to kick out and look these fans in the face and say, no way. I'm not giving up. We're not done here today on America's birthday. And it is the 4th of July. Yes. Poncho's trying to speak for him. Referees is absolutely not. Poncho's translating. Now the crowd firing up Matt Longtime. I can't think of a better way to play the 4th of July, dog. Up elbows to the stomach. And he pulls him back down by the hair. And Derek Jones knows that that was a blatant hair pull. The, ref the referee care. warning Poncho. He has the count of five, right? Now what's Poncho going to do? Mr. Wrestling. Mr. Wrestling's taking way too long to call his shot when you know the grizzled veteran. That might have worked on Eddie the Bruiser Cruz. He's green, but I don't think it's going to work on the Love Machine Matt Longtime. Oh, and right he sidesteps it! Whoa! Big hammer! Whoa! The Love two Machine, hammers. a house of fire. And Poncho is a real with a flying clothesline to Scott Missile by Matt Longtime. One! No! I believe so that. close, so close. Everybody in the building thought that was it, my friend. 2.9999999, etc. It doesn't get any closer than that. Poncho sitting there saying, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Like, that's going to stop anything. Oh, he missed the drop kick. And Poncho, one, two, three. What an upset. What an upset. Poncho. I think that's the upset of 2020.
All right, my mother truckers, did I tell you or did I tell you? That matchup between Jose Acosta and Not Bad Chad, unbelievable, huh? And then again, very rare current footage of the love machine, Matt Longtime. That guy right there is entertainment personified. Don't forget, support us on Patreon. Subscribe to us on Pivot Share. Go to Pro Wrestling Tees for some cool ass shirts and keep checking back every week. And again, our live event tapings or our live tapings are every Saturday night in Woodstock if you're close to us and have the means. We'll see you next week when PPW represents Challenge Pro Wrestling. <laughs>